Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm traveling to Tokyo for my birthday. So I'm on my way to the airport. By the way, the wax lady literally waxed off my skin, off my top lip. But anyways, how can I forget my um, all my bank cards at home? So my mom's literally in an Uber on the way here. And I've checked in my bag, so I'm just gonna wait for my mom to come, drop my um, drop all my bank cards, and um, get going. Only me, only me. My mom is literally such a sweetheart. She came all the way here in an Uber. It was literally an hour away. Drop my bank cards because I needed that in Tokyo. Imagine being stuck in Tokyo without bank cards. Sorry, I ain't never making it back. Now I'm on my way to the business lounge to get some food and wait for my flight. I'm currently at the boarding gate waiting to board. I'm so excited. I have been dying to go to Tokyo for the longest. If you guys know, one year ago, I wanted to go to Tokyo. I booked the hotel, booked the flight, everything. Got to the airport, and this was like just after COVID times where you could travel, but it was still issue washy. Anyways, I get to the airport, and they're like, no, you can't fly without a visa. Um, yeah, you're not getting on the flight took me away from the airport, lost my flight, lost my hotel, paid for everything for me and my mom. Never got the money back. But we're here today going to Tokyo and I'm actually going with some friends that I met in America. Whilst I was on my solo trip in LA, I literally wait no, was this in LA or New York? No, I made a I made friends in New York on, and they invited me to go to Tokyo and I was like, "Yes." The fuck? And here I am. The rest is history. So, I'm so excited. Sorry, I actually I need to process this. I'm so excited I can't believe it it's my birthday today I have 20 minutes to go out and get I have 20 minutes to get ready because we're gonna go all out for dinner but let me show you guys my room real quick so as you walk in this is the bed how beautiful is the ceiling and then here you have a little um here you have a little kitchen which is super cute and a microwave and then you walk through here a little office space wardrobe space and the marvellous bathroom which is so gorgeous you have your toilet here with heated seats and the bathtub this is too good guys it's too good and let me show you guys the view it's unreal
this. This is the best matcha I've ever, ever had. I got matcha with oat milk and vanilla syrup. And I've never tasted matcha this good ever. service it just hits a nerve it just hits a nerve it brings out something in me guys how beautiful is this view please sorry i just woke up my voice sounds effed up but um please look at this view so gorgeous i'm gonna get ready to do my makeup so guys ignore my hair for the next part of the video because it's too hot and I just need to do my makeup real quick. I think everyone's out, but I'm low-key so jet lagged. I can't I can't take myself seriously with this hair, but but ciao. You need these what it is. Especially when I'm on holiday. Sorry, I don't want an itinerary. I don't want to wake up at 10 a.m. Like I wanna wake up in the middle of the afternoon and do what I wanna do during the holiday. That's my vibe. If I'm on like a work trip, it's different, but if it's my holiday trip then I'm so, I'm sorry I'm waking up at whatever time my body wakes up so yeah get it I guess I'm using the NARS skin Loki I love visiting a new sissy by myself and just like getting up and doing what I want to do so I'm just gonna meet everyone later and then I'm gonna go in with my refi for my lip when I tell you guys Tokyo is so hot right now it literally feels like I'm in Dubai I've got AC on full blast and the window like the heat from the window is still hitting me so bad and i caught a really bad flu on the plane from the ac but i think that was from ibifa because i was i was in ibifa then i came to london for a couple days and then i went straight to tokyo so i feel like my body hasn't really had time to rest this is why today i just needed a lay in low key so first i'm gonna brush up my eyebrows with this I'm trying to just bring it forward so I can create some hair like strokes at the front of my eyebrows because one thing I hate about my eyebrows is that they're so fast spaced like hair literally doesn't grow here but I'm scared to get my eyebrows micro is it called micro micro something very much something because it just gives tattoo and I'm scared it looks great though I've seen like really nice videos on TikTok but just like i'm the type of person that i might want something today and i might not want it tomorrow with the eyebrow tattoo stuff it's a little bit too permanent for me like i can't just get, wake up and not want it anymore so i don't know i'm still thinking about it i wasn't gonna do it but i might i don't know yet <laughs> guys i'm so ill it's my birthday week i'm in tokyo and i'm literally so ill but i'm just fighting through it because nothing nothing is gonna stop me from living my best life sorry then i'm just gonna go in with some concealer this is the Too faced born this way i kind of like it when i'm ill though because my voice sounds croaky like hey hey no i sound like a frog I feel like my eyebrows look so much more natural when I don't conceal them at the top so I literally just conceal the bottom and then at the top I just put a little bit of foundation or tinted moisturizer or whatever it is I'm using that day I'm using the makeup by Mario palette the colors are literally so pretty you have a color for everything and I'm just gonna go in with a mix of these and just slightly blend it out just so that my concealer doesn't look too too light I'm just going to try to blend it into the eyebrow 
I literally refuse to wear foundation in this heat, so I'm just gonna use some tinted moisturizer. This is the Laura, Mer this is the Laura Mercier one. I really like this one because it's full coverage, but it's still a tinted moisturizer, so it's not like thick on the skin. <laughs> Sorry, mine is actually really filthy, but it's because I use it so much. And I'm in the shade 5W110. For tinted moisturizer, I know this is kind of wild, but I just like to apply it with my hands and really make it penetrate into the skin literally just apply this like it's cream because technically it is it's just tinted cream i'm so sorry if you see any boogers in my nose i'm actually so ill I really want to contour so I'm just going to use my NARS bronzer in the shade um, Laguna 6. I think my camera just overheated. It better not play with me today. Then I'm going to go in with some highlight, well concealer. I'm just gonna put it at the I'm just gonna put out the corner of my eye a little bit on my chin um that's it I don't want to do too much I'm gonna go in with my urban decay setting spray sorry if the angle slightly changed my camera overheated again um but guys I really need to get internet I'm trying to figure out how I can get internet because my ED is not working like at all I don't know why so I think I'm just gonna go out and buy a sim card or maybe like um a Wi-Fi router, you know when you can buy the little portable Wi-Fi boxes? But anyways, I'm just going to put a little bit of highlight. And to be honest, my makeup is done. I don't want to do too much. Doing your makeup in natural daylight is low-key humbling. Like, my makeup doesn't look like this at home. It looks, you know, pretty good. But in natural daylight... Who am I? Oh, who is she? I'm just gonna go in with a little bit of lip liner. This, this is the Cork Lip Liner by MAC. I'm gonna go in with a little bit more refine on the top just to make it nice and glossy. It's giving skin. Guys, if you don't have one of these little mini straighteners, honestly get one. It's, su it's such a game changer if you are if you do leave outs all the time or you have your natural hair or tapes or whatever because it gets the root of the hair. It's literally so good. I actually got mine from my friend. Thank you to my friend. But, I, but I'm pretty sure you can get one on Amazon for like £10. I'm just going to go in with some got to be and spray some of my hands and then I flatten any flyaways. And then I'm going to go in with the GHC Sleep Talker and use a tiny teeny bit, literally like two drops and then just mix that into my hand and put that on the hair. Go for straight or curly hair? Mm, I think a little curl at the end will look cute. I'm using my tea free curler. This is literally the best curler ever. I'm not even exaggerating. You know with other curlers where you have to wait like so long for it to get curly? This literally makes your hair curly in seconds. Like it's so precise, it's so good and it, it looks like this.
is the part that I've done already. I really don't want tight curls, I want it to look just loose and wavy. Just gonna lock that in. Guys, that is my hair and makeup done. I've got this dress. So cute. Just on my way to some vintage stores. I want I really want to find some nice vintage pieces. I found loads of vintage shops on TikTok. So I'm on my way now, it's 30 minutes away. I kinda wish I went out earlier, but it's not too bad because the shops close for around eight and it's like 5.20, it takes 30 minutes to get there, so I'm gonna get that for six. And yeah, I just, I just wanna explore and be a tourist. never seen anything this cool ever. AC, like my body cannot handle AC. But on a positive note, my money raised no quitter, so I'm gonna go out tonight. I took a nap, but I'm just gonna top up my makeup. As the jet lag today was so crazy, I, I put the room on do not disturb so that no one could like knock on the room, and I forgot that it was on do not disturb, and my phone was off, everything was off. I went to sleep at 5 a.m. and about 6:30 p.m. I was like, oh my god, no, I've missed the whole day. I'm gonna make up for it tonight and literally turn up. I just went for a little nice walk in the city. I'll insert some clips now. such a beautiful city there's really always something to do anyways inevitably i know i'm going to come back to tokyo because it's one of the most beautiful places i've ever been one more time i can't believe i'm 22 guys you know what because i started social media so young i literally started when i was like 30. I just feel like I've been doing this for so long that I feel older than I actually am because I've been exposed to so many people at such a young age. I'm super blessed to be on this journey with all of you guys and I'm so blessed to have so many people see me grow throughout the years and everyone honestly holds such a big place in my heart. It's definitely, it's definitely ble a blessing and a curse, like social media is crazy but it's opened so many doors for me for sure. Okay, now I'm gonna go in with some contour to be extra snatched.
literally lost my only lip liner that I had, so I'm just gonna go in with some Refi lip gloss. Now time to do my hair. And that's my hair done, guys. Now I gotta get dressed, so let me show you guys what I'm gonna be wearing. So yeah, I'm out for the night. Yo, he just hit me back. What is that? The, the nigga. What Serious? Hmm? So guys, we're going out. It's my last day in Tokyo. And yeah, we're just waiting for everyone to come down. <laughs> yeah, we'll be doing this. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Stupid. Goofy. Goofy yeah. Goofy yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Okay, say, say konnichiwa. Konnichiwa. Nihonjin desu. De, kono gorgeous na hito ni aimashita. We met the most gorgeous person tonight. <laughs> for the night, for the night. Girl, for the night. For the night. Uh, for, for the light, actually. Is there she's the, she's the girl for the light. <laughs> she, she, wait, honestly. He's a, he's a Trisha. <laughs> that means prostitute. That's fucking rude. Oh, no, uh, what what, what did you say? Girlfriend. I mean, I mean, prostitute. Oh, really? Yeah. You better sorry, make sorry, sorry about that. Sorry about that. I'll, it's I'll okay. Print, yeah, I'll print. No, it's not okay. okay. Oh, sorry. I'm sorry. I apologize. I was in the shop. I'm sorry. I said, I'm sorry. I, said, I'm sorry. Oh. I really apologize from, my, from, from the bottom of my heart. Do I look like a fucking prostitute? No, no, no. You, you're really, you're really gorgeous. Oh, thanks. You know. so how do you say thank you in Japanese? Arigato. Arigato. Oh. Oh. What does that mean? What are you saying? I said you guys are the most gorgeous and the prettiest <laughs> women right now in Japan. <laughs> yes. That's what I said. Uh. No, I'm, honestly, honestly. Guys, I missed my flight, so. I guess it's another I'm not even mad at missing my flight Loki because I have a whole extra day to explore. But Loki I wanted to travel on the 4th, have a day to rest in London but I guess I'm not going to have that day but it's Loki fine because I can just get to London and then um, I can get to London, sleep for the night and then go to the gala in the morning like it's fine. Yeah I'm going to keep you guys updated, I'm going back to the hotel now. So guys I'm going out for dinner, I'm wearing my Chanel tank top, a little skirt. to me. 